Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Grace from Gracie's Diamond World and if this is your first time stumbling on my channel, I would love for you to stumble, stay and subscribe by hitting the subscribe button and the notification bell which will go ding each and every single time I upload a new video. I have some exciting packages that are have arrived, are arriving, are in the post box that I can't even access right now because they're closed, it's a whole thing. Let's get into it. Before we get into what's in my package down here, why don't we do what we always do, peeps, and throw some love out to the Patreons of the channel. My Patreon family, thank you so much for all of your support along my journey. Let's throw some love out to these peeps, and you guys, I'm going to see you on the flip side. Come with me. Come on. You don't want to miss what's in this package. Ah. Okay, we're back, we're back, we're back, we're back. Hi, <laughs> I have a package. I said, you don't want to miss what's inside here. I don't want to miss what's inside here. I only wish I knew what was inside here. That's going to be a problem for me. So what I'm going to do is you can see it's still sealed. I don't mind showing the address because it's my PO box. So, you know, go for it. Yeah, more than welcome. There's the address. <laughs> it's always in the description box below. This was sent to me by a budget company. So I'm going to take one thing out. I'm gonna to have to research where it's from and then come back to you. But I promise, I promise you, I am not going to look at what else is inside. So let's just slither it open a little bit and let's just take out one little thing. Um, and I'll hopefully be able to, well, well, I say one little thing, let's take out this thing. Okay, all right, I see what this is. So now that I know what that product is, which is here, and I'm gonna show you in a minute, I'm gonna now find out where it's from, one sec. Yes, I did the research that I needed to do and I know where it's from, oh my goodness. This is a PR or promotional video. Thank you so much to DP Clubs for sending out these products. They had reached out to me over the course of the last few months actually, and I wasn't uh, in a position or you know ready to bring you some videos for quite some time from a budget company and they reached out and I finally answered them. This took about, um, I wanna say about three, four weeks to get to me. So let's get into the first product. I took it out so that I could reference what it is. And guys, I'm telling you now, you've probably seen these products by a million other, um, what do you call them? What are we, creators. <laughs> but I've never, I've never had these things. So I thought I'd get one. And it's a, apparently, some sort of vacuum cleaner. It says desktop vacuum cleaner. Shall we get into it and see what it's like? Shall we, shall we? I mean, we might as well do it together, right? Because why not? Oh, it, this is even fancier than my normal vacuum cleaner. Look at all these bits and pieces. Okay, so it comes with, I don't know if that's just for packaging or, okay, hang on. Oh, it's got, See, can, is that focusing? These are kind of like bristles, see that? They're bristles. Um, does it, is this, oh, okay, no. Maybe if we read the instructions. Hmm. Hopefully they are instructions. Let's pray that they are instructions because otherwise I will have no clue. It would be good if I could open said instructions. <laughs> Gosh. Ah. All right. Fabulous. It says to press for power. No power. Oh, replace battery. Okay. Here, replace the battery before pressing the face button. Okay, so hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. We go, do we press this first? I don't wanna break it. Does it come apart? And I don't wanna bust a nail, I will cry. <laughs> oh, 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 something's happening. It's alive! It's coming apart, but clearly. All right, I'm just gonna kinda. Mm. This is not long nail friendly, peeps. I can't, oh, oh, sugar, okay. 
we need us some batteries of course we do let me go get some i'll be back i dare any one of you to ask me why i have so readily got available double a batteries but no usb all the way people come on get to it get to it get with it get with it if you've come to know me at all usb all the way something in that goes there we put the plus with the plus and the minus with the minus okay we've got the batteries in now what do we do remove the top okay we've removed the top cover to i guess we just put this on top again do we just replace okay oh oh i feel something oh can you hear this hang on let me put it in my microphone hang on can you hear that all right so the idea peeps is that you have a spillage and like because i'm a bit of a <laughs> i've got just drills randomly on my desk here just like because you know I, I randomly have i've got some drills diamonds there they are oh my goodness spill 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 i've spilt some diamonds and the idea is this thing is supposed to um th i think sweep them up oh oh left two okay great they're in there now how do i get them out <laughs> um it's i'm looking at the instructions here it says twist oh there they are look see can you see them in there so i guess then you would just tip them out into your container as required right i see i see okay so i like this i mean i don't know how it would go on carpet has anyone got one of these and does it work well on carpet i guess it would how does it i mean i think i, I oh be good to quote oh okay so arrow arrow look at that look at that shimples shimples i'm thinking does it just oh don't don't break it gracie i think that's all you do yep i can i can feel it i can feel it now what's this duty insert the vacuum tube into the bottom hole oh baby <laughs> We now have, um, we now have this long thing here, <laughs> um, to suck up things. Um, so let's try, you know, if we want it to be like bougie, can you see? It's sucking them up. Look at that. So that's pretty cool too, right? Oh, and then you've got to turn it off. Okay. Any other instructions? No, that's it. What's the brush for? What's the brush for? Hmm. <laughs> Let's um oh, okay. I'm guessing like if you had to, you know, brush these out, you could. But there you go. Oh, I don't think that was supposed to <laughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Happened. Goodness, I'm coughing up a lung here, but that's okay. That's okay. No need to call the paramedics. I'm good. Oh, I guess. Um. Damn. I think it just kind of. No, I don't want to. I want to. I don't want to force it. Oh, bugger. Is there a special? I guess. Okay, so let's match. Let's try and match the. There we go. Gentle, gentle. And this pops. Oh, let's find that arrow again. Let's pop that on top. And let's um, pull him out. 
<laughs> and, um, so yes, vacuum cleaner. I, look, I love the concept. I've come how many years without needing to vacuum anything. However, I didn't have one. I know there's many, many variations of this little fella out there in different kind of animal sort of shapes and things. Let's pop him over to the side and let's see what else I got from DP Clubs. Who's got a vacuum cleaner and has it ever saved your life? I want to know. And when I say saved your life, I don't mean giving you CPR. I mean as in your diamonds. All right, what else did I get? As promised, I haven't I haven't looked, so I don't know. Oh my goodness. Oh, let's have a look. Open. Comes in this baggy or big like ziploc bag look at this it's a you know one of those boop, ziploc bags so that's good if you want to take it somewhere it is ladies and gentlemen out there yeah? oh my goodness it is ha ha <laughs> jenny with an eye Uh, <laughs> um, Jenny with an eye <laughs> from the Uncrafty Crafter. If you are watching this, <laughs> have at it. Go for it. <laughs> I will explain to you what that is in a minute. Let's go with what's in here. We get ourselves a bit of a bit of a basic kit. We've got a, a boat, some wax, a pen, and some plasticky tweezers. And we've got our diamonds here. These are special. Um, diamonds, special drills. We'll have a quick look see. But hang on, hang on. Before we look at this, oh, it, there's no lines. It is the 4th of July. And you diamond paint the front of it, guys. If I could lift this. And it will, yeah, it is partial. So every, it, see where all the shiny, like the actual, anything that basically is not this background, you will be diamond painting. And I will be forever reminded of the 4th of July. <laughs> uh, uh, I, I, I'm going to leave it at that. If you want to know, if Jenny watches this and if she wants to tell you about Gracie and the 4th of July, <laughs> Jenny, you've got my blessings, my love. But I thought I would get this when I saw this was available to get. I kind of uh, had a bit of a, a, a small internal chuckle because now I'll never forget Jenny. <laughs> uh, it's got a bit of a vinyl leathery thing to it. So I'm, I'm really liking that. Maybe it's a sign. Let's have a look at the diamonds that you get or the special drills, if you will, and the colors. So it's a bit of an orange uh, crystal blue yellow just a normal black it's not playing very nice with the um let's go like that red silver oh and then we've got the stars because of course the stars and stripes so look it's a very quick project something that i reckon would be lots and oh lots and lots of fun pardon the bump bumps of roonies with the camera Lots and lots of fun. I don't have, I, I don't believe, and I'm, I'm not mistaken, this is my very first ever notebook. I may or may not have ordered other notebooks from other companies. When I say ordered, requested to to show you. But um, I'm really, really digging this. So you got the flag, you got the eagle, and of course the 4th of July, which is actually coming up, funnily enough. It is actually coming up. What else did I get? What else did I get? What is this? Oh. You know, you order things so long ago, I forget. I forgot. I forgottens. I forgottens. Let's open it up. But I remember what this is now. Again, I don't know if you've seen these before. Oh. Oh, it's a bit of a... Oh, you smell. It's like they farted. Oh. <laughs> a tool kit. This is without tweezers. And we've got our diamonds. We'll have a look at that in a minute. And this is a little hanger upper thing, like a little, like a hangy, hangy thing. Yeah. And I thought this would be super cute. Look. 
look at that. So you got little, some people call them gnomes, other people call them, oh, what does Rose call them? What does Rose call them again? Oh, I can't remember. And if Rose watches this, I'm sure she'll tell me in the comments. Rose from Rose Prophet Creations. Um, I guess you could do this one of two ways. You could either thread it all the way through. Yeah, like, like thread, thread, thread. Is it going to come out the other end? Hello, commute, commute, whatever you are. Come on. Come on, you little. Is it out? Got to get in the hole and pull it out. There we go. So you could, I like, you could do one of two things. You could string her up like that, which is probably. Oh no! Oh, now I see. Now I see the reason for this. You don't just do that. You've got to put the stick in. You got to put the stick in the hole because it makes it stiff. <laughs> <laughs> this uh, video has gone all sorts of directions right here. You could either do that or maybe twist it around like so. You know, use your noggin and then put a nice little bow and hang it up like so, you know. But we've got three little gnomes. Oh, what does Rose call them? It's bugging me now. Oh, and three different little pictures and they've got shine flowers how super cute that one almost looks like a dragon and then we've got a big sunflower here but there's pockets like a, remember the old-fashioned letter holders who even writes letters anymore right even bills come in our electronic mail these days but I figured this one would be something really cute to show let's have a look and see what sort of diamonds and special what knots we get with this one. Oh, it's bugging me. No, then she doesn't call them gnomes. She calls them something else. Ugh. Anywho's. All right, so we get three of these. Um, oh, so the way you don't get a legend on, on either one of these projects, there's no legends. So each one of these, I should have explained. Beg my pardon, it's been a hot minute since I've done this. So each one of these has got a number, see, five, six, blah, blah, blah. And you match it to what's on here. See all the numbers, okay. Similarly here, this is like a big star. Now I, I can, I'm looking at here and we only really need two of them. One up here and one down here. And it's got the number eight on there. And then we've got the rest of them and you just pretty much follow your nose. See how they're numbered? Zero, one, two, three. You know, you guys can count. See? Six, seven, all the way to seven. These are our colours. So orange, black, silver, yellow, green. That's um like a dirty gold. And then we've got these orangey marquees and some stars look at that some stars and basically unless it's an obvious shape so these ones here are going to go on here right yeah easy easy you got this guys you got this it's super easy um a nice little something something as a project for yourself again to give as a gift if you want to give it as a gift to someone who's into the gnomes <laughs> Something different to have. You know, all these are off, what do, we, what do we call them? I haven't had them for such a long time. Off canvas projects, they're always lots of fun. Always lots of fun. So let's pop that one up there. My goodness. Got a bit of a, got a bit of a something, something happening here. What else? Is, did I get something else? Oh, I did. What's this? What's this? What's this? Hmm. This feels really weird because I thought it was a diamond painting but there's a big square bit here and I've got no clue I think that's all there is yes there is let's put that down there let's put this on his side let's pop that up there and that there and that there because I got no clue um it's been opened or it wasn't shut properly yeah you take your pick take your pick 
be very very careful because it's I can see a canvas so it's, it's, it's a canvas of some description I am confuzzled oh it's packed tight I really am confuzzled I have no idea what is going on here and I still don't there's some diamonds lots of greys doesn't look like there's any special drills oh Oh, well, that, well, that's, 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 oh, okay, all right, that might have given it away, because now I think I know, but this is not what I was expecting it to be, interesting, basic toolkit, right, we've seen it, we know it, there's our diamonds, there's this gizmo, let's have a look at what this is, uno, due, and let's, um, pull you out a bit, no pun intended, so that you can see it all, come on, there we go. Uno, due, e tre. Aha. It is a clock. Interesting. Now, it says 35 by 35. Oh, goodness gracious. It's been a hot minute. I don't even know where my tape measure is. Look at me. I've got a ruler. <laughs> Good. Let's do it the old-fashioned way. It is going to measure. It's a bit crinkly. It's a lot crinkly. It's uh, 29 and a half. That way, by about the same that way. So it's not 35 by 35. That's going to be canvas to canvas, canvas to canvas. Let's see if I can flatten this. She's really like a lot crinkly. I haven't done a clock before. I haven't got a clock at all to do i honestly didn't think this was going to be a canvas maybe i looked at it wrong thinking it was something a bit different uh, so this will be fun i think it will need to be ironed out but i thought that as a clock face was absolutely gorgeous and i think once it's diamond painted it will be even more gorgeous -er. I like the fact that the numbers are all one color they're in that E whatever that E is which is this let look at this legend the legend is really weird so what have we got we've got a symbol a Q a C I mean love that for me look at those two colors so close together Oy vey. I'm not real and look at the O I mean you're gonna really need to be concentrating between the O the Q and the C I mean seriously oi vey that's that's gonna be and then look let's not why don't we just throw a D in there a capital D for good measure so looking at this drill field I'm really, really, I'm, I don't even know if a light pad will help or hinder. So the Q is the lighter one. The Q is the lighter one. This greyish background is the O. Oi, oi, oi. It's going to need a bit of concentration. Luckily, it's only a small one. Lucky. The diamonds, well, they're pretty muted in colour. There's nothing really gung-ho special about them. I uh, don't think there's going to be any ABs in here. I think they're very, like, you know, greys, blues, the glare is balls for you. Love that for you guys. Let's see if we can do it that way. You get a better idea of colour. A little bit of purple. More greys and blues. You're really going to need to be loving these darkish sort of colours. Um, to be doing this painting, that's for sure. That is for sure. But it is only a small one. My question... My question, <laughs> you know what my question is, right? My question is, 
Where is it? So it's got 19 colours. Where, oh, there's, a, I was going to say, where do I poke that? But there is a hole. Look at that. Focus, focus for the peeps. Oh, and there's, you're going you're gonna to get a better idea of the drill feel like that too. See her schnoz? See her schnozzy, her nose? You're going to poke the, this through the schnoz. Um, and there's the rest of the drill field. But you can see all the numbers are quite um, clear. I might substitute those white ones for our ABs, actually. That would be how I would gracie, gracie, bling, bling. Actually, this is giving me Eva vibes. Yep. Eva. There's a lot of blues in here. More greys than blue, but it's giving me sort of blue vibes. This thing here, though. Bugger me if I know. This might have to be a project for offspring number two to assist me with. This is kind of his thing, his gem. And again, we need batteries. Lovely. Oh, yeah, this is going to be a... There's not even any instructions. Did any instructions come? Let me just have a look. No, nothing. Niente. Nothing at all. So I'm going to have to Google how to put one of these little gizmos together because you get all those bits and pieces. Look at that. Oi, oi, oi. And then that. So I'm guessing what's going to happen, this, this here is going to go and poke like you're gonna to have to poke a hole through a schnozzy. This will sit on the back, and then you'll have the hands going around on the top. Assuming though, because this is gonna have diamonds on it, that the hands will have to sit slightly elevated. See what I mean? Know what I mean? So this could be a really interesting project because I had thought maybe to put mount this on a canvas, but then you have to allow for this space this this room here so I don't know how because I'm not going to just put this on the wall like that I want to mm, I am going to see this one through at some point for sure for sure and come back and show you all the things and how it's done oh no 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 let's um put that in like that yep beautiful all right well how's that for a different selection of items from DP clubs Thank you so much to DP Clubs for sending these through to me. I really, really do appreciate it. Um, if you've enjoyed today, I would love for you to give a thumbs up on your way out. And which one of these did you enjoy? Which one of these have you already got? Which one of these do you think would be the funnest to do? All that stuff. So with all that being said, wherever you are in your part of the world, I hope you're looking after yourselves. I hope you're looking after each other. Have each other's backs. It's so, so super important. Until I see you guys next time, I'm going to send you all much, much love. And ciao, ciao for now.